Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Pokemon Silver. Since last time we defeated the... Well, I was going to say the Cinnabar Gym, but that's not actually true. We defeated Blaine and got the... his badge. I forgot, I didn't mention that. After we beat him, we get a 12.5% boost to our fire type moves. And right now, we only need to face blue. Yes, I did. Oh, really? Well. I got to say that Tanto Gyms were not that hard as well, so... But Blue is actually not a pushover, it leads with a Pidgeot of 56. You know, Squeak Attack, Hurling, Wing Attack and Mirror Move. He actually has some decent levels on him. Now his Rhydon is at level 56 as well, he knows Fury Attack, Sandstorm, Rock Slide and Earthquake. But I do know Earthquake as well. I didn't want shot it, so you know that it's going to be hard. And I am dealing super effective damage, so I should be okay. I'm getting hit by the train by a ride on. But, yep, as you can see, Blue is actually challenging. I was going to send his ace, Harkonine, but they actually don't have a good response for his fire Pokemon, so let's just bring Umbra with my Pokemon. And Harkonine knows Roar. Swift Flame Thrower and Extreme Speed And... Oh, let's go around and lower his special Avran can actually take the hit, so... Although I'm not really... I'm not really doing that much damage. And let's see if I can survive this one. Probably not. Oh, I survived. And that should be enough to deal with Arcanine. I don't really need Umbrian for... Really? Well... I don't really want to... Lose Umbrian just because... So. It's probably going to use it. I could at least went for another... Not a Shadow Ball, that way. I had the chance to lower the special once again. And 
and one more should do it. I hope. And I should survive this one. Oh, I actually need it. I shouldn't risk it that much with that potion. I actually need it for later. Now it's probably going to send off Gyarados. Gyarados, sorry. Yep, let's bring Amphi once again. Gyarados knows Twitcher, rather. And forgot how to speak once again. Twister, that's what I meant to say. Hydro Pump, Rain Dance, and Hyper Beam. Okay, Rain Dance. Okay, it's actually not that great. That's okay, that's not really a great problem. Oh, it's a lot really because I'm actually going to stay with Anti. Because I'm not 100% sure that I can outspeed your Alexa. Uh, Alexa. So got some nose disable, recover, psychic and reflect. And as long as I survive this, I'm going to defeat it. And I should, yep. Pokemon that he is stupid. That no sunny day, Lich Seed, Egg Bomb, and Solar Beam. I actually want to go for Return in this turn. I don't know. If... Okay. My bad, I forgot to say I had Reflect. So, she's going to do the bite. I really forgot about that one, so on my bad. Yep, it's going to take. So, at, at this point, and now we'll need it. And we be cool. So, yep, the levels were already catching up with us, with us so. By the beginning, we get the hurt patch. Uh, maybe one day, maybe one day. Now, by beating him, we get a 12.5% boost to her type moves, although Blue is not really a ground type Pokemon trainer, but it's still the Viridian Gym Leader. Now, as full cast, once you got all the badges, yeah, you unlock the path to Mount Silver. You actually do need to talk to him, it's not uh, like you get the badges and. Oh, forget about that, forget about that. But, as I was saying, you actually need to talk to him. If you get all the badges and simply go to that path, you'll be blocked, so... The fastest way is simply go to... Right here, and... Go to the left. Now, I haven't played... Generation 2 in a really long time, but I'm pretty sure that it is better for me to go right now there. So, so really, in the last spot. No, that's okay. Won't be getting that many encounters, probably. So, here in Route 22, we can find 
Watata and Ponyta during the night, and during the day, Spiro, Watata, Dodo, Piro, and Ponyta. Uh oh, counters, thank you. So, yeah, picking right here, it was locked. And now we are, we are at Route 28. Let's go for the details. And here you can find in Pokemon Silver, Ponyta, Tanplan, Dolphan, Gapidash, Dodo, and Dodo Ryu, both morning and day. And at night, you can find Ponyta, Tangle, Dolphan, Gapidash, and Sneasel. Oh, I need to go around, okay. Gotcha. And in Pokemon Gold, you can actually find. I meant to go over here. But let me just check something before I finish what I was saying. Yep, you can fly directly to Mount Silver. I just wanted to get this spot here so I can fly here later. As I was saying, in Pokemon Gold you can find Ponta, Tangla, Ustering, uh, it's the same thing but swap to Dolphin for the Ustering. Yeah, sure. Well, here you can you get the M47, that one is the wing. It's actually the second one we get, right? Or I'm mistaken. I can see, I can see. Yep. Second one. So. Before. Let's run this so you can find the right candy. Faster if I do this. So I don't need to use cut. And. Is it here that I want to go? Yes, it is. If you go around here, and in this spot, you can find a full store. And that's everything you need. Summit of Mount Moon. But before going in, let's go to the front first. I want to use the mark. I'm not going to use the money for anything else, so might as well. Buy as many as I, I need. So, once again, let's just go back. And I want to go to Ecrotic City. And actually, I'm already healed, so. There was one place that I didn't explore when you were at Ecrotic City. And you can only pass through here if you defeat the fortune leader. But that only gets you up to this spot over here. You actually reach the tower, but you cannot get inside. I really don't like this place. It's a hassle to move along. So, so that was one. Where am I? Let me just select something. Okay, I'm at first floor. Is this one? All these little tiles are more of a hindrance than anything else. I think I need to go over here first, exactly. Get the super potion. One. And in this spot, you can fight an even to restore. 
There are three items in this place. Oh, that's where we need to go, I think. But before going there, we actually need to go over here and pick up Max Potion. Let's do. Oh, this is the one. Oh, I. Oh, my God. No, no, this is the place I need to come. But let's go. Oh. That's not the one. That's why I don't like this place. I hate it. I hate it. Here, then left, down, down, right, then it will freeze the matter, so it's down, down, left, left, left. I actually need to go over here, pick this one up, we can find the carbos. Now I need, there's no more even items. So jump, jump, there we go, there we go, there we go, and right one because so we can find the rare candy so I just need to find oh. that was not my remote to go We can place Watata and Ghastly here, nothing else. directions on my walkthrough is not are not that great. Take this one as well. Okay. This should be the last item. Um, oh, there's actually one more. Let's see. Jump, jump, jump. We will back to where we came from. This time, go all the way down here. There's only one. 
Wild Max. Same as here and before going to that one, let's the final item. And that should be hit. Thank God. And we get our prize on top of the tower. But if the other battles taught me anything is that this one is going to take forever, so I'm going to end the episode once again in this place. I'm really going to try and fight the last legendary bird of this game on the next episode, so I want to thank everyone for watching and see you another time. Bye!